We're in Brussels. We boarded a plane 12 hours ago in LA and I didn't sleep and couldn't feel my legs one hour in <laughs> for the rest of the flight. And then uh, <clears throat> we landed in Paris like four or five hours ago, took a train from Paris to Brussels. Now we're in a Simon's Cafe, waiting on Mark and Simon, oddly enough, uh, to pick us up. I'm having my second cappuccino of the evening. <laughs> Wait, no, we came from there. Shut up. <laughs> yeah, and maybe we need to go like to the left. Start. How you want to go then? You want to go here? We made the it. We met up with Mark and Simon, and they're now fighting over how we get home <laughs> <laughs> or where we're going <laughs> to our new home. Then we go there. Then we go now. So. Yeah. I want to go so. I want to go left here. Oh. All the big cities, uh, they're very. The people are very oh, into themselves. How is this an intersection? Right. What is happening here? Yeah, how, how are you How do you know driving? to go? We don't know. Where are the lights? We don't know. What? what lights? <laughs> we don't need lights. This is Europe. <laughs> <laughs> lights. <laughs> so some lights. This is Europe. There's like some lights. Giving me anxiety <laughs> just seeing what's happening. This does feel a little bit like LA rush hour. Well, I'll say. No, we have lights. <laughs> we do have lights. Yeah, we have some. Okay. Merci Homer, t'es un véritable ami. C'est pas comme Lou, t'arrives trop tard. Le chef, j'ai dormi sur ce canapé depuis une semaine. T'as raté mon réveil, c'est tout ce qui compte. Oh. <laughs> Good morning from Belgium. Um, we're having a nice Belgian bready breakfast. Croissant. And then... Just an assortment of bread products and potatoes, my own mason jar ketchup, and then a huge salt shaker. <laughs> it's sunny today in Belgium, which is awesome, because it was rainy and really cold. I'm assuming it's still cold though, but at least it's sunny. Yay! This was too large. Okay, yeah. it's a cool shot, huh? Yeah. Because I did it like this, I pushed it. What would you say if you could see me now? What would you do if you. Hey guys, going to uh, sing See Me Now on the radio here in Antwerp at the radio station. Jet lag's kicking in pretty hardcore right now. So, let's see how this goes. Okay, okay. Is it nine? Is it That's Andy? Hi. That's Harold. Hi. He's from Canada, so. Otherwise, we were first thinking about doing it on the DJ booth separately. Okay. But the problem is, if we do it there, we have a delay of 10 seconds and we don't know how. To, well, we know how to fix it, but it's gonna suck. Yeah. It's horribly. Yeah. So we're just gonna put it all in the studio. So you sing through the same mic as we do the, the studio showing. I have a vocoder right next to it, which you can use the way you want it. Oh, that's what we call it. Sex Sex Sexy hey, phone. And uh, tell me about this collab, because I mean, you're a guy from Belgium, from the Gimbo, <laughs> and he's from LA. How, how the hell did you guys meet? Uh, uh, LA's. It's okay. No. Good. Yeah. Much different than American States. Well, it's the same. It's like more quaint. Quaint? Yeah. But it's quaint. Like, it feels uh, like... Like uh, home, like home. Like, ah, okay. Yeah. It feels like, like the Northeast, maybe, a little bit. cell phone card so we can actually make phone calls and we'd be able to get a hold of people. What does it cost? 
What are we getting, Mark? Pashka. Pashka. It's uh, chocolate cheese. Huh. <laughs> An assortment of meats. Something European. And then we get some chicken bread. Oh, between you and sandwich or something. It's not like uh, it's bread. It's chicken bread. No, but it's like called bread. It's called chicken bread, but apparently it's not <laughs> chicken in the bread. That sounds kind of good, though. That sounds like an American thing so that would like happen. A, like just deli meat. Yeah. It's very good. Okay. If there's something else you guys want, just, just uh, I don't know if you want cheese or... It's also colorful. You guys have things like this? Yeah. Yeah, sort of. Not... Uh, it's French, eh? Carpentier. And it comes from uh, Charpentier, and that's a uh, <laughs> oh, no, I thought you were playing the hi-hat for a second. I was like, no, 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 drums. <laughs> What's up, guys? I'm here. Uh, oh, I am recording. What's up, guys? I'm here in the car with Mark with a guess. This is my my brother from another mother here in Belgium. <laughs> and uh, he's just speeding down the road. How many kilometers an hour are we going? Oh, only 100. Oh, only 100. Okay. Everything is we literally know zero <laughs> measurements or language. It's liters, centimeters. Uh, no, we're trying to figure out how much gas he puts in his car and how much it is, and we're trying and to like miles. talk about LA gas prices versus Belgium liter. You're like gas so price. close to your face. Pull it out. Am I? No, like, I'm not that close. No, you are. We do 8.7 liters per hundred kilometers. Oh, really? But that's yeah, but that says nothing to you. No, that means zero. <laughs> I, I think of it like in liters of Coke. You know, because that's what we have. We have Coca-Cola liters. <laughs> there you have liters. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Only, yeah, it's like a two liter. That's what we call it. It's only weird. when we're, yeah. Only our unhealthy food is like that. I don't know why. Weird. Yeah. Is that good? How was the peshka? It's like, it's dessert. Yeah. It's like a, I've, I'm eating all of this. <laughs> I want to try, I want to try some. You have to try it. How do I get it? Just like, scoop a little bit. Yeah. It comes in house. Okay, and then just like bite it. Yeah. Uh, how about talking to you made it? Yeah. Mm. Terrible view. You like it? Wow. That's amazing. Yeah, right? <laughs> it's like... It's like a chocolate cake with cheese. <laughs> <laughs> but you can't... It doesn't taste cheesy. It it's tastes like, like creamy. Just, yeah. yeah. Voila. 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 What's up? Yeah, that's cheesy. Brother house. We have the show, Big Brother. Oh yeah, we remember that. Yeah. Biggest TV show. <laughs> Biggest TV station. Are you still recording? Yes. <laughs> but you can't see me. That's where the studio is now. Biggest TV station in Belgium. Ooh. Quick. Mm. Oh. I don't see it at all. Kids know who you were? Kids no, know. yeah, probably. Yeah, I, don't know. Know. I don't know. Probably most people. Hi. 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 It's, it's. <laughs> oh my god, she's coming to mind. <laughs> there goes the jet lag. <laughs> yeah. That's what I said. I was just going to fall asleep. As soon as she started yeah. doing that. Yeah, he's having troubles, huh? He's having trouble now. <laughs> no, no. If you have a lot of on jet lag, <laughs> he fell asleep in the car twice. <laughs> fell asleep in the green room <laughs> almost. <laughs> okay. I don't know how active he is. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm all done. <laughs> go crazy. It can be a meaningful song. It doesn't matter what genre. Put it in. Good song, crazy song. Mm -hmm. And there's a lot of hard music that has really. And of course, there's one guy, uh, the vocalist of the song. You put a lot of emotions in the song. Also, you you told me earlier that you uh, collaborated via Skype and uh, yeah. little hangouts. But I was wondering, how did you how did you find him? I find him via YouTube. I was looking for a good singer, um, and I came across because he's doing a lot of covers yeah. on his YouTube channel, and I heard him sing uh, 
heroes, mm -hmm. and I was like, wow, wow this guy is amazing. So yeah. I contacted him, and uh, he responded back like, hey, let's do this. And two songs together, right? Since two songs, yeah. yeah. Did you have experience with that? The mystery guest is kind of hot. Kind of sexy. <laughs> <laughs> well, wow. She's single. <laughs> At least, and she's honest. Yeah. You know what I mean? <laughs> That's what I love. Honest girls. <laughs> well, it is 6... 5. 5 a.m. in the morning. 4.50. 4.50 in the morning. Here, it's uh, 4.50 in the morning here in Belgium, in Antwerp, and I am headed over to the, the biggest radio station in town with Mark to sing a version of See Me Now, an acoustic version in the morning. And I'm having my hot toddy, waking my voice up, enjoying the blackness of night, <laughs> and thinking about how big this lamp is, and then also that I'll take those bikes out later. What's up guys, I'm running ground. This is my buddy Mark with a K. It's almost 6.30 a.m. and we're here at the radio station M&M here in Brussels and we're about to perform See Me Now Live, right? Totally. Yeah, we're excited. It's an acoustic version, just a piano and vocal. Mark's gonna do an interview, talk about the song. We're really stoked, so hopefully we're awake. Yep. We'll pull it off. <laughs> <laughs> around all this weird like old historic radio equipment and we're walking into the studio right now it's gonna be really fun is this some tesla stuff i feel like this is like some weird electricity tesla things Yes. Mark knows more about American movies and comedians than I do. <laughs> Straight up. Four? Four? Why not? Please? Um, I guess four. No. 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 Eminem, back of the day, please. Zebra. Beko. I'm bored. Say this. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> another elevator. So the, when I got off the elevator, the mic was right in front of it, and I thought, oh, it's going to be interesting if I'm singing and someone gets off the elevator. But now they've put the mic in the elevator, as you can see, and they're holding the elevator for me for the rest of the day, so no one can get, get in or out. It's nice. <laughs> Not quite, but this will be my first time singing in an elevator and being recorded, so that will be fun. <laughs> okay. Okay. <coughs> Come on. Dates alright. Everything is fine. You see, I'm only reaching out for you. With my hands up to the sky, I'm singing, oh, 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 this one's for you. And I'm singing, oh, 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 this one's for you.
chats with Harold, myself, and Mark, and uh, we finally got the new song where it needs to be. So and it's, it's the very first time in Belgium, I guess. Yes. I like Belgium. First time in Europe. First time in Belgium. I love it. It's beautiful. I mean, it, it feels uh, it's cold.